The following presentation will discuss the pipeline notice, providing some information on the purpose of the notice, as well as giving an overview of the information required when the notice is published. The pipeline notice is designed to provide markets with advance notice of anticipated public contract opportunities. This change is intended to lead to an increase in competition as it will allow suppliers more time to prepare their resources and determine if they wish to bid. This will especially benefit small and medium sized enterprises and voluntary community and social enterprises who have less resource to respond to public sector tenders by providing them with time to plan for future work, ensuring a competitive and vibrant market. These notices are compulsory in certain circumstances and are required to be published by contracting authorities with anticipated spend of over £100 million under relevant contracts in the coming financial year. For organisations who are required to publish them, a pipeline notice must be published for all public contracts, which the contracting authority anticipates will have an estimated value of over £2 million. Below threshold contracts can be advertised in a pipeline notice, but it is not compulsory though it is encouraged for works contracts valued at over £2 million. The notice must also cover public contracts which the contracting authority proposes to enter into for the forthcoming 18 months. The pipeline notice should be published within 56 days of the first day of the financial year. While the pipeline notice is intended to provide suppliers with an indication of contracting authorities' plans, it is important to note that the contracting authorities are not held to the information in the notice, which could change over time. The notice is intended to be updated as the contracting authorities' intentions evolve in response to events and emerging organisational requirements. This notice is also not required to be published by private utilities. The following information must be included when publishing a pipeline notice. Though please note that authorities should refer directly to the regulations and associated guidance as this information is only being provided as a general guide to the notice requirements. The required information is information about the contracting authority, the title of the procurement, the unique identifier relating to the procurement, the contract subject matter, the estimated date when the tender notice or the transparency notice related to this contract will be published. A full list of the information required to be included in this notice is included in the published regulations and further information is provided in the associated guidance.